Good morning, viewer. Bien, that's your real breaking news from India. Yeah, Honorable Prime Minister of India, Narendra Modi, will contest again from Varanasi in the upcoming Lok Sabha elections as the Bharatiya Janata Party released its first list of 195 candidates for the Lok Sabha polls. Naming 34 union ministers, including heavyweights such as Amit Shah and Rajnath Singh from their current Gandhinagar and Lucknow seats, respectively. The BJP list also included two former ministers and Lok Sabha Speaker Om Billa, who once again got a ticket from Rajasthan's quota, and former Madhya Pradesh Chief Minister Sibrat Singh Chauhan from Vidisha. The BJP's first list included 51 seats from Uttar Pradesh, 24 from Madhya Pradesh, 20 from West Bengal, 15 each from Gujarat and Rajasthan, 12 from Kerala, 9 from Telangana, 11 each from Assam, Chhattisgarh, and Jharkhand, 5 from Delhi, 3 from Uttarakhand, 2 each from Arunachal Pradesh and Jammu and Kashmir, and 1 each from Goa, Tripura, uh, also the Andaman and Nicobar Islands, and Daman, Dew. It also replaced as many as 33 sitting MPs with new faces. In the first list, the BJP fielded union ministers such as Mansuk Manbia, Jitendra Singh, Sarvananda Sonwal, Gajendra Shekhawat, Bhupendra Jadav, G. Kishan Reddy, Kiran Nijju, Jyoti Dradito Sindhya, Rajiv Chandrasekhar, Arjun Ram Meghwal and Arjun Munda. The BJP made major changes for Delhi, dropping Ramesh Biduri, Poresh Barma, Minak Sileki and Harshubaddhan from the respective seats. The party has named Pravin Khandelwal as its candidate from Chandni Chok, Kamaljit Serawat from the West Delhi seat, Bansuri Swaraj, daughter of late BJP leader Sushama Swaraj from New Delhi and Ranbir Singh Biduri from South Delhi. The BJP fielded Bhojpuri singer and actor Pavan Singh from Asansol in West Bengal. The list also included 28 women and 47 young leaders in Jharkhand. Former Congress MP Gita Kora has been fielded from Singmung ST Reserve State. Be the report.